Hi everyone, happy Monday. Wow, today's the last day of September. Tomorrow is October 1st already, and time is just to fly in. Well, tomorrow also starts the kickoff of National Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and so I will be doing pop-up giveaways. Um, some Gifts will be to have something to do with uh, breast cancer awareness, and I've showed you some of the gifts that I have already purchased. So others will have to do with Halloween because it still is the month of Halloween. And there will also be some other things thrown in there here and there. So I may just come on on a day that I don't have a video planned and just decide to do a pop-up um, giveaway or I may just have it at the end of one of my videos. So if you want to participate in the giveaway, you will probably have to watch the whole video. All right, today I'm doing some shout outs. It was really hard to choose. It's like, I wanna do this person, but I will tell you this, everyone I will be giving a shout out to. I have been chatting with a lot of people. I've made a lot of new friends. I have seen so many new and new videos and, you know, of people who are coming in and they're doing different things. And also of, you know, my all my channel family members, I do feel very blessed to have you, each and every one of you, in my channel family. Um, without you, I couldn't have my channel. You know, I, as I was saying, I, I have chatted, I have made many new friends, and I just love it. It's, I love talking to people. As you can tell, I love to talk. But anyway, I'm going to get started here on my shout outs. And again, if I didn't get you today, I'll be getting you. You're going to be out there. Your name's going to be out there. Um, I'm going to be doing this today. And then on Wednesday and Friday of this week. And then next week, I'm going to just do it one or two days. I'm not really sure yet. You know, I, I don't have my agenda for next week made up yet. So we'll see. But let's get started. And the first person on my shout out, I've been with Sandra and Sandra's been with me since almost day one that I've opened my channel up. And Sandra's Halls. Now, if you don't already know Sandra's Halls, my goodness, you need to go over to her uh, channel and check her out and subscribe. Sandra is a really nice lady. Um, she works very hard at her channel and she has hauls from Dollar Tree, the 99 cent store, um, and she has hauls on seven days a week. So go over and see Sandra's hauls and have a little notebook and a pen or a pencil with you because I jot down things that I know what to look for. Sandra lives in Canada, so sometimes she'll get things before we do, and that's where I find them and say, okay, I know what to look for now. Sandra's Hall, go over and see her. The next one, and um, this man has been with me almost since when I um, opened up my channel also. And this, he used to be Jamie's life, but he's now Disney, D Jamie's Disney Kingdom. Now, Jamie does a lot of fun things on his channel. He has an uh, evening where he does coloring. He does some lives. Uh, he cooks. He he takes us, you know, He wa when he walks to the library sometime, you know, he'll take us on the walk. Um, otherwise, he'll go to the library and he'll get a lot of movie, Disney movies, and then he'll come back, he'll watch them, and then he rates them one, you know, five and ten. One, I wouldn't rent this movie again or buy it. Five, eh, maybe. And ten being, yeah, I like this movie and I might buy it. He has, he's very magical. He really loves Disney. I love his intros and outros, and he's always changing them up. He also shows uh, videos with his dog, Ar Ariel, and I believe he just got a new dog by the name of uh, Elsa. Is that right, Jamie? If it's not, please correct me. So, yeah, go over and see Jamie's Disney Kingdom, and um, tell all these folks that Budget Joe sent you. The next person is Serendipity's Closet. Her name is Sandy, and she is a fantastic lady. Now, I watched her, I always watch her videos, 
And she is the lady that I learned how to make the witch's hats and the Santa hats from. Sandy does a lot of really good um, videos, especially when she's learned, and she's a really good instructor to learn from. What I did with Sandy was I watched her video and said I could never do this. I, I just could never make this. Um, and then I went out and bought the supply list and I saved her video and I went step by step with her on the video because that's exactly how she teaches you. She is doing this step as she's teaching you. She's a wonderful lady and she and you can learn really easily from her. So if you want to learn how to make the witches hats that I make, I can do, you know, um, a video showing you how to make them. But I can't, I'm not as good as she is. And I would probably be, have you, have you so confused and, um, you wouldn't be able to learn from me as quickly as you could from Sandy. Now, those hats are not my creations. Those are Sandy's creations. And I gotta tell you, I was just on her, uh, channel today. Go over there. You should see what she's doing with the small witches hats. And I can't wait to do to work on those too. So yeah, go over and see Sandy Serendipity's closet. The next person is a man who has a lot of compassion, and his name is Rounded Rob. And I really like him. Um, he has a he has a lot of aquariums or, or fish tanks. And I have to tell you, um, he has a fish and his name is Ozzy and Ozzy is a Oscar fish and I don't know what it is about Ozzy but I really really like Ozzy. Now Ozzy became sick and I have to tell you I watched Rob take this fish out of the, his aquarium and he laid him on a towel so that he could you know give him medication or whatever he needed to do for this fish to make him well now you would think that this fish would be flapping around because he's out of water he's out of his element but i gotta tell you that fish had to have um the instinct in him that he knew that rob was there to help him because he didn't do any of that so he by the way he um ozzy is much better now thanks to rob and i gotta tell you another thing he to me rob is like an earth angel because he really helped that fish so please go over and see round rounded rob he's really a super nice man and the next person is my friend, Hello, Hello, and I absolutely adore her. She is just such a sweetheart, and I just recently started talking to her not too long ago, but we clicked because we have so much in common. Um, we have, you know, crafts that we talk about, um, you know, she's Italian, I'm Italian, and we got some background back there with the mafia, so it's like, yeah, go over and see my friend, hello, hello, she does blogging, she does um, reviews, she does crafts, and, she, you know, she just is an uh, just a all right girl, I absolutely adore her, so please go over and see her. The next person is Den Boy, and Den Boy is in Australia, and I absolutely love his Australian accent, but I also love his videos. I'm never going to get to Australia, but I've been there because of Den Boy. I've been there in his videos. When he shows his video, he makes his video and shows them, it's almost like you walk into the video and you're standing on the countryside or wherever he's at, you're right beside of him. His videos are gorgeous. He shows the countryside. He shows the lake, the parks, the animals. He showed something the, uh, not too long ago, the nightlife that they have there for things to do after dark. So please go over and see Den Boy. He is truly, truly a wonderful ch uh, uh, channel supporter. I really have a lot of respect for this man, and please go over and see him. The next person is, I call her Miss Semi Homemade because that's what her name should be, but her name is actually Life with Patty. Now, if you haven't watched Patty, Life with Patty, you need to go over there and see her because I'm going to tell you what, this lady cooks, she bakes, she has a night where she also has some coloring, she reads stories, 
she, oh my goodness, she does so much. It's like, um, she'll talk about her coworkers and she doesn't say anything bad about them. She says all good things about them. Um, she tells a little bit about her job. She talks about her husband and her, her, her sons and her grandchildren. And she makes some of the best looking casseroles. And the reason why I call her Miss Semi Homemade is because she went into her pantry one day. She wanted to make some cookies for her son and grandson who were coming over. She went into her pantry, grabbed a can of pie filling, went in her fridge, got some cream cheese and a already made pie crust. And she had cookies made and they looked scrumptious. Go over and see life with Patty. You won't be sorry. Okay, the next person is someone who is new to my channel, but I absolutely love his channel. It's informative, and I like it because I like abandoned buildings and cemeteries. And his name is Rouge Exploration. And I, I hope I'm saying that correctly. If I'm not, please correct me. Um, go over and see his channel. He, he's taken us to abandon, an abandoned theater, um, and if he can get inside, he'll go inside and show us what it looks like inside. If he can't, then he shows you the building, and, you know, he just, uh, if it's on a block, like he just showed uh, a video this past week where there's a lot of abandoned buildings. He couldn't get in them, but he showed how this whole one section is just all abandoned. You know, and him and I talked and we can't understand why these states, when they have these abandoned buildings, why can't they do something for the homeless, especially for the homeless veterans? We here in Cleveland, Ohio, have veterans who have fought for this country, who have given, you know, they were ready to go to war at any time because they signed that piece of paper and they're living in our public square. That's not right. But anyway, let's get back to the abandoned buildings, because if I get started on that, oh my gosh. Um, but yeah, so please go over and see his channel and, join, you know, subscribe. He has a great channel, especially if you're, and then he goes to the cemetery. Um, I'm a cemetery person. I, I'm always looking at old headstones. I'm always looking to see if it could be haunted. Um, things like that. So yeah, go over and see him. Just two more after this one. The next one is Miss Magical Mary Poppins, as I call her. Don't tell her. Her name is Lisa from Lisa's Paradise. And she is one terrific lady. And I'm going to tell you what. She has a really good channel. Her and her husband, when they're on together, oh my goodness, they just make, you can just see the love between them. But not only that, but they do some funny things. They actually, uh, Lisa herself did a um, potato chip. It was really hot potato chips and with nothing to drink with it. And so she did um, a challenge for that. And then her and her husband did a challenge where um, they put some cinnamon in their mouth. They tried cinnamon. And when they opened their mouth, this big old puff of, of smoke like from the cinnamon came out. And that was pretty funny. Um, but she does um, hauls for Dollar Tree. Uh, she does Walmart hauls. She um, does crafting. I absolutely love her channel. I love when she puts the music on her channel because she plays some really good songs. She shows cleaning with her. Um, her the the uh, she's a professional nanny and she shows you know with the children and you know the the people that she works with and. She also has had her grandchildren on also. So please go over and see Lisa from Lisa's Paradise. The next person is Strange Dreams. And I got to tell you, this man, he does challenges and he doesn't care. He does challenges. Um, he just puts little, little bits of videos on and you just never know what he's going to do. He's cleaned his carpet. He's done his dishes. He's cleaned his pool. He's been swimming in his pool. Um, he showed us his muddy yard. Go over and see him. You, I'll tell you, you just don't know what he's going to do. All right. And my last one is my girl herself. Sweet Sadie J, and I just love this lady. She always has a smile, always has a positive outlook on things. She does hauls, both grocery and Dollar Tree hauls. Um, 
she takes us on the drive when she's going over to see her mother, who she is a part-time caregiver to. She has taken us to Olive Garden with her and her brother for lunch. She takes challenges. She takes us on walks. Sweet Sadie J, please go over and say hello to her, and I hope that you will look each and every one of them up, and you will subscribe to their channels. You won't be sorry. I'm going to go back over their names real quick, because I'm coming up in 14 minutes. So, Sweet Sadie J, Strange Dreams, Lisa's, Hall, Lisa's Paradise, Rouge, Exploration, Life with Patty, Den Boy, Hello, Hello, Rounded Rob, Serendipity's Closet, Jamie's Disney Kingdom, and Sandra's Halls. So I hope that you will go over and see each and every one of them. Tell them Budget Joe sent you. And have a wonderful, wonderful day. Don't forget, guys, I'll be back on Wednesday with more shout-outs. And who knows, I might even have a surprise giveaway pop-up soon. Bye.